Good morning, Bird Brains. Welcome to day two of the uh, Oklahoma trip. I don't know if you could, if the mic is picking it up, but since about 6.30 this morning, it's just been a constant rumble of bikes going down the highway. Uh, we're staying right off of the route in between Grant and Paris. So anybody who is staying either at the campground or up in Grant is having to take the route past our house or our Airbnb to get to um, Paris. So it's really just been a constant rumble since about 6.30 this morning. As you can see, where you woke up to a pretty awesome view. Only bad thing about staying out here at this Airbnb is that when we came home last night, there was just swarms of bugs. Here's a clip from that. It's, uh, I guess, one downside of staying by the... Oh my God. Other than that though, it's been a pretty pleasant experience. But uh, I want to show you guys how awesome this place really is. So I'm going to go ahead and throw the drone up. This is a hard time. It's so humid out here. My lens keeps fogging up. I, I can't, I'm sorry, I can't see if it's hoax or not. So yeah, so it's gorgeous out here. Now we're actually uh, gonna go get a bite to eat and then we're gonna meet up back with John Maxwell over at Paris Harley-Davidson along with hopefully some other people. So let's uh, go ahead and cut to that. All right guys, so we just finished up having breakfast here at McKee's family restaurant, 24 hours. It's kind of like a gym's in San Antonio. Kind of like a little hometown IHOP. Very good, very tasty, very nice people. Uh, the town of Paris is excited to have us, guys. <laughs> they have been so excited to see people, talk to people, see where people are from. Just awesome Texas hospitality. Uh, met some fine folks from Virginia and Pennsylvania. <laughs> yeah, Virginia and Pennsylvania. <laughs> nuts man Washington Michigan um, Dallas Houston of course nuts man you good all right event and it is absolutely nuts i don't know how much i got of us actually riding in i'm having gopro issues of course like the biggest event of the year i'm gonna start having problems but uh it is just absolutely nuts in here kind of weave our way in between all these bikes and now we have to go stand in a really long line to get our wristbands and then attack for the bikes apparently so we're gonna go stand in line for a long time so uh, we just got to look at how long the line actually is. Thank you guys. Once again, just trying to be safe. We're going to give everybody a safe and in their spot. And we're going to leave your orders. Even if you pre-register, you have to go to registration. You have to get a bracelet. It's not on there. And then we've heard again that you lose like two. Hey. 
So the line is so long, we've been uh, pushed into the street. So literally an active highway right there. Right there. Where'd y'all ride from? San Antonio? Yeah. I follow your YouTube channel. Oh, cool, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> I seen you walk by, but I couldn't catch you. I oh, seen, yeah. I seen the. It's pretty crazy right now, man. Like. <laughs> oh, yeah. <that's> <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the sticker. No problem, man. Appreciate the support. Two hours later. What's up, bud? Appreciate the hey. support. <laughs> John Maxwell pointed out the decal. He's like, hey, check it out. <laughs> right here the awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you later, man. <laughs> oh, his face is priceless. Yeah. Yeah. Like What's up, man? Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Max earlier. Yeah. Gotta get there you go, man. You gotta get a picture. Absolutely. Ow. There we go. <laughs> You stabbed me. You stabbed me. You got stabbed with a gnome. <laughs> <laughs> like, of all the things. They're, they're speaking about, about heat here. Oh man, looks like I'm wearing a v-neck. That's gay. So uh, we're here in the inside the Harley other ship because it is so hot outside. It's only about 84 degrees, but it's about 80% humidity and it's just god awful. Uh, Harley ran out of water already and it's 11.30. And it's been a while, so it's probably closer to 10.30. But uh, I think we're gonna go head across the street and get something to drink. Me and Maxwell keep crossing paths. I haven't ran into Sandoval just yet, but uh, meeting people left and right. So this is, this is awesome, guys. Thanks for coming out and showing support and showing your faces. All right, so it's about uh, an hour and a half after we just registered and check out the line. It's, it's just as long, if not longer. <laughs> oh my God, look at this. Look at this line. What's up, man? How's it going? Can I go with you guys real quick? Absolutely, yeah. All right, please. All right. Oh, Only yeah, if I can get one with you. Alicia. All right. That's my name. Alicia. All right. All right. You guys are awesome. Yeah. Right. How long have y'all been in line? Huh? How long have y'all been in line? Just like we got in right now. Oh, oh man. Damn. When we got here, the line was right there at the edge of the pavement. It still took us about an hour. Oh, wow. Woo. This could be a hot one. Sorry, bud. <laughs> Oh yeah, man, what's up? Channel. Thanks, appreciate it. You want a sticker? I would love a sticker. Can't awesome. forget you, I got a guy that he's at the gas station. What's, what's your name, buddy? Dustin. Dustin, nice Justin. to meet you. Nice Dustin, Justin. 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 <laughs> Have you already registered and everything? Oh yeah, I'm already yeah. stickered up. Right oh, right right. Home, right How long was the line when you got in? Actually, so, I mean, it was about this long. No we got shit. in probably about 20 minutes ago, but the fact that we pre-registered, we caught the lady at the door and we were Ooh, lucky. Yeah. We, were, we were in line, uh, and it was right at the edge of the street. Yeah. We got about halfway up, and a girl started walking through with a, a clipboard. Oh, and we nice. got in, and it was still about an hour from when yeah. we were in it. So. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I saw your bike over there, man. That's, uh, yeah. I love that. I that love that. That red helmet dude. just pops in that, that sea of bikes, right? right. I love the... Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Look at the dog on the bike. Look at the dog on the bike. Hi, oh, buddy! <laughs> water. Yeah, I think we should grab water. I'm going to buy you girls some water. No problem. So it's it's gotten even hotter than it's gotten even crazier guys we're about an hour and 15 minutes away from kickstands up and it's still just absolutely nuts we still got people running all over the place uh, Adam's finally here so I'm trying to go see him and uh, maybe get some some camera time on him I love your videos man yes I do big fan big fan Yo, where are you at? You're like, I'm in Missouri. I was like, yeah, that sounds about right. I just did a flashback of your sticker on mine. I got, I got a few stickers. So. Cool, man. Big fan, man. man. Keep it up. Yeah. We love you. Thanks for coming yeah. out to the record, man. Thanks for, Thanks for being part of the show. Harley Davidson Motorcycles. 
That is the achievement we are trying to accomplish today. For any reason, if it is not, it does not have the... 15 minutes from kickstands up. Clean shirt, bracelets, and headlight sticker, Harley's only. Y'all ready? Okay, woo! 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 Yeah. All right, let's go. You have to have you ready to go? On your headlock. We apologize <laughs> Nervous, if you got any people don't have that sticker, <laughs> but you have to have that sticker. If the numbers are here, it you better have it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the execution's the part. part. Oh, oh, sorry. Somebody? All right, y'all. Hey, I just wanted to come on and thank everybody for coming out here today. Uh, I think, I truly believe in my heart we're going to break this thing. All we have to do is, like the man said, start right and finish right. A uh, quick thing about myself, a lot of you don't know or may know, I myself never served in my military. Temptations and poor choices in my 20s kept me from doing that, and in my 30s, it became a real regret. And now I put a lot of my efforts every day in the things we do, and all of you along with me, to giving back to my military. I've got a quote, and it is, if you did not serve in your military, find time to serve those who did. And if all of us, if all of us that didn't serve did just that, we wouldn't have military out here wanting for the basic things this country has to offer. So I'd like to say today, I hope to hand over a check. And when I say hand over a check, I want to be crystal clear. I'm talking 100% of the money, all the money Paris Harley Davidson put into making this happen. All the money the Choctaw Casino put into making this happen. All these first responders and police officers out here who we all better be thankful for have put in. Okay? None of the money from this registration goes to pay any of those people back. 100% of that money goes to the Combat Andrew. Vets Motorcycle Andrew. Association. Yeah. All of us have donated our time and money to make this happen, just like y'all. And uh, I think we came together and we're going to do it. So I'm going to ask y'all for two things. One, I want y'all to make some noise for all the veterans that we have in the house today. Let's make some noise for them. Yeah, that's pretty loud, but I want to punch a hole in the sky. I want every soldier we've got overseas away from their family, away from their loved ones, so that we can be here today breaking world records and bringing them home. Punch a hole in the sky, make some noise, that they'll hear all the way overseas. Let's hear it loud. that note, I'm gonna hand this back to this, yeah, there we go, that's some noise, amen brothers, and sisters of course, everybody should know that right there, that's the sound of the Americans, let's bring it home, yeah, yes sir, nice to meet you man, Oh, okay, cool. I was gonna say, can come find us, but you already got taken care of. Yeah, man. All right, man, we're gonna go line up. All right, good luck. Yes, sir. All right, guys, it's about time for kickstands up. Over 2,000 motorcycles. Here we go. Let's do this.
hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, go ahead. Yeah. We did it! Yay! We did it! We did the things! All right, guys, we're gonna go get cool, shower up. We'll meet back with you guys here in a second. And here we are, all nice and showered. Now, we're here at the casino here at Grant, Oklahoma, and it's funny seeing these bikes like in the small parking lot was one thing, but seeing them in a giant open parking lot, good God, is there a lot of bikes here. It's quite ridiculous. Uh, I'm gonna go try to find Maxwell and Adam Sandoval and see if we can get a confirmation on uh, if the number has been met or not. No one's ever gonna see you again. Probably so, not. Yeah. <laughs> happens, Respect. Happens all the time. Respect. Yeah. I'm time. sure. I'm sure. <laughs> Let's get it, Adam. How about it, brother? You got this. Good evening, Oklahoma. You guys have had a few beers. My name is Mike Mark. I have been on that. I'm an adjudicator with Guinness World Records. We are based out of London, England. Today, we are all here for the largest Harley Davidson parade. I was still around earlier today and looked at license plates from various states. Uh, and I found, I personally found, over 25. Bike. Yeah. Was registered with your VIN number, the number on your motorcycle. Hell yeah. Not coming. <laughs> with that being said, the record to beat was set in Greece, the country of Greece. Back in 2010, they had 2,404 bikes. Bikes. We count. We don't count bikers. There's like 4,000 of you doing Facebook Live right now. Where is it here with the plaque? Uh, unfortunately, uh, you did not break the record today. A couple reasons why. Bikes did not finish. We had bikes break down. Uh, bikes uh, couldn't make it in the heat. We also had people who registered and they did not register with a Harley Davidson motorcycle. They used a Honda or a Yamaha and, or a Victory. Unfortunately, those don't count and they create false records for us um, and I cannot uh, present a flat to you. However, I know. However, I have much better news to share with you all before you take off here tonight. And with that, uh, a guy that many of you know well, a guy that I just met for the first time today, everybody give it up for Adam Sandoval. Well, <laughs> we tried, guys. Listen, one thing I'll tell you right now, I just spent a bunch of time up in the hotel room there with, with Guinness Book over here, and um, as sad as it is that we did not break this record, there's much, much more important things happening here. All right, guys, over $32,000 donated to our veterans. That is something to be proud of. And our American pride will carry us through this record. We'll do it together, y'all. Keep your chins up. Stay proud. Let's make it happen again and again and again until the record's ours. Amen. Let me, make, let me hear you make some noise out there for our American veterans. Let's do it. Due to your protesting, thank you for asking politely. Um, we had a number of 1,911 bikes who officially finished the route. 
What more? What have we got? But we had 2,152 registered. Only 1,000, what was it? 1911. So what they do is they take the lowest, they, they count it three different ways, they take the lowest number, that's what they go off of. So we have to get the highest number possible. Okay. Not this guy's fault, he did a great job. We're bringing him back when we break the record so he can watch it. Alright guys, so we're here outside the uh, Chalk Talk Casino. Unfortunately, we did not break the record. We came in at 1911, so we missed it by quite a bit. Talked to Adam, got a quote from him. I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. But uh, we're actually headed out to K River Campground right now to uh, hang out with him and John Maxwell. So hopefully I'll get the actual quote again. I'll have to ask him to re-record it. But uh, we're gonna go grab a bite to eat on the way. And hopefully I'll see you guys back at the campground. Tomorrow. Ah, I'm such a bad YouTuber, guys. I'm so sorry that I just kind of just let you drop off last night. Just kind of walk you through basically what happened is uh, first off back at the casino I missed that shot with Adam but got a cool picture of me getting that shot with Adam here it is <laughs> it was so good his quote was so good the lighting was so good everything was so good and uh, I didn't hit record so but it happens to every youtuber ever ever that's been on the YouTubes after that we uh, went and got some to eat and met up with Adam at Adam and John Maxwell out at the K River campground I could have reshot the shot with Adam but one the lighting out there is terrible because it's a campground and it was at night and two Adam looked like he was just done and not to say that he wouldn't have reshot the shot um, he, he definitely would have it's just I respect him too much uh, as a fellow content creator to go up and not only because I mean he's probably been busting his ass trying to get this event sorted for months now and when you're ready to unplug you're just ready to unplug so I can respect that I don't hold that against him because I didn't even ask him to get the shot so why would I but anyways that's basically how the night went uh, the Cape River campground is pretty dope well uh, we only saw it at night so we didn't get to see the full uh, beauty of it but uh, definitely would like to go back there again in the future other than that, guys that's going to do it for day two I got to end this video so I can go ahead and start day three as we make our way back to San Antonio so just want to say thank you guys love you guys I met so many of you people you people that sounds terrible I met so many of you guys this weekend it was truly an awesome experience it's definitely been the biggest event for me so far as far as meeting fans and taking pictures and things like that so I just want to say thank you guys for coming up and saying hi and just supporting the channel and it's really kind of just lit that fire under my ass again to get out there and start creating videos again so just thank you that's all I can say alright guys so if you like this video go ahead and hit that like button if you haven't already go ahead and punch that subscribe button as always thank you for watching I'll see you guys next time